of the four top seeds in the semi-finals today. The one anomaly is Koki Watanabe. Barely inside the world top 20 in his career. Through a section of the draw that featured Srikanth Kadambi, Lakshya Sen and Vidit San's absence from the draw has certainly been noticed. Well, here he is then, Koki Watanabe coming out to court. Please welcome. It's been in pretty good form this week. Koki Watanabe will take a look at his results in a few moments' time. But what about this man, Lee Zizhia? Back on form and in form. semi-finalist here last year. Lost out to Kunlavut Vititsan last year in the semi-finals. Looking to do one better, at least today. For the toss, I have red. First meeting then between these two. Black. So you have red. It is black. Service. Okay. Well, Watanabe has got a challenge ahead of him. The massive attack of Lizzie Gia is about to be rained down upon him. Here's his profile then, 24 years old, from Koshigaya, which is in Saitama in Japan, five foot five in height. 37 in the rankings. That ranking of 34 isn't recent. That was back in November 2019. He was up there for three weeks. So quite a surprise for me to see this name come through the draw of big names and into the semi-finals today. For well, that match in round two, Toma Jr. Popov, possibly the highlight. What a third game result, 21-5. Really, the damage was done in the second, 24-22, coming through that in 59 minutes. But to beat Tamazin and also Lee Chuk Yu as well, a solid week for Koki Watanabe. 24-year-old Lee Zijia, six foot one in height from Alor Setar in Kedar, Malaysia. From number four in the rankings, he was up at number two in the autumn of last year, about October time for, well, nearly three months. Number two in the rankings, slipped recently. And what about that opening game? Li Shifang, 23-21. It's worth mentioning at 21 all in that third deciding game against Li Shifeng. There was a red card given to the man from China. And it was all very bizarre. I don't know a great deal more about it, but very unusual circumstances, loads of drama. Straight games wins after that in the round of 16 and the quarterfinals. Southeast Asian Games gold in 2019 and Asian Championships gold in 22. Our umpire for this one, Jörg Heisel from Germany. And Mr. Darashevich from the Ukraine is our service judge. Ladies and 
Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Lee Tijia, Malaysia. And on my left, Koki Watanabe, Japan. It's a year to serve, love all, play. Wonderful straight block Two, from Lizzie Shell. Well, Watanabe lost out in the round of 32 One, last year two. to Christo Popov of France. He took some vengeance this week, but on the other Popov, Thomas Jr. in the round of 16. This year, not yet in full flow. I knew if I'd say that, he'd pull out a big smash. Service over. Three, four. Great touch from Lee, but an incredible pickup from Watanabe. Service over. Five, four. Wonderful shot. Well, he's not to be underestimated, this man. Six, four. And I get the impression some of these big names have done just that. In his smaller frame. And is higher ranking than most. Wonderful shot. Found the line, Lizzie Service over. 
five, six. Change. 358 that measured the smash from Lee. Fast attack from Watanabe. Eight, seven. What a smash from Li Zizia. Service over. Almost Eight, unplayable. Ten. Service over. 11 8 interval. Well, it's Koki Watanabe with the advantage at the mid game interval. And you just get the impression. Lizzie Gia hasn't shown enough respect to his opponent so far. Gone long. Twelve eight. Well, the drift inside the arena seems to be moving around from where it was. Earlier on today, I've seen shots drift from right to left only by an inch or two. There was two in that previous rally that seemed to go the other way. Difficult conditions for these top players even to play in. Well, I'm not sure what that was. Lizzie Gia seemed to 
to change his mind. Requiring a change of equipment. Oh. Well, a surprising scoreline. Going out as well for me. Lise Ugier is just not quite in the right frame of mind to compete at this speed. He seems quite lazy in his approach and occasionally brings out the big guns to hit a big smash. But typically, a lot of these rallies are being won by sheer hard work from. Koki Watanabe. Service over, 19, 10. 20, game point, 10. Well, 10 game points, but not for Lee Zizier. And Lee Zijia happy to defend and eventually just give the point to Watanabe. And there it is. Heads in the wrong place in game one. Let's see if he decides he wants to turn this around in games two and three. 21 11 the scoreline. The 37th ranked men's singles player, Koki Watanabe with the advantage. Second game. Love all. Play.
Yeah, it's brilliant from Watanabe. Signs that Lee's year was One, moving faster no. into the net to try and win that net exchange, gets himself the lift. But a good fight from Watanabe. Watanabe's first title win was the US International back in 2018. Service over, one, all. Also a 2019 Orléans Masters winner against his teammate in the final. Service over, two, one. Great net from Watanabe. Oh, it's too good from Koki Watanabe. Three, one. He had Lizzie Gier in all kinds of trouble in this rally. Smash from Watanabe. Service over. Four, two. Just missed the line. He looks to have barely broken a sweat, Lee Zizier. Which is unusual because at the... Six, within a split two. second, he can do this kind of stuff. Incredible effort. Shame he missed. But if he's capable of such explosive movements, you have to wonder why. He doesn't seem to be putting in his best effort. Seven, two. All credit to Watanabe. wide again. Well, Watanabe seems to have picked up where he left off in game one. Service over. Three. Nine. Great disguise at the net from Lizzie Gia. Service over. Ten. Four. Eleven. Four. Interval. Well, it's a very unusual performance from the Malaysian. I have to wonder whether there's some physical problem. There seems to be signs of intensity there when he wants it. He's just not at that level throughout every rally. But Koki Watanabe putting in another fine display, full of intensity, full of positive play. And he's up again, 11-4 uh, at the break, a seven-point margin and one game to the good.
20 seconds. 20 seconds. Going wide. Service over. Twelve five. Oh. Well, what about that for touch from Lizzie Shear? Service over. Six. Smash winner. Seven over. Seven. Thirteen. Yeah, wonderful play from Koki Watanabe. Seven over. Fourteen. Seven. Well, it's difficult to watch when we've seen Lizzie Gere perform at such high levels. Good control by Watanabe. Lizzie unable to play the winner. Great net play from Watanabe. Service over, 17, 10. Watanabe inching ever closer 
to a place in the final here tomorrow. The other semi-final, of course, we'll see in two matches' time. Seven Victor over. Axelsson and Chia Tian Chen 80. coming up in an hour or two. Judged. Great shot 20, from Watanabe. Match point, Eight match points then for Koki Watanabe. Oh, just wide. Would have been a special end. Service over. 13 20. Gone long, Watanabe. Eight. Fourteen, twenty. Yeah, wonderful shot from Watanabe. Well, it wasn't the loses year we are used to witnessing. But what a day for Koki Watanabe, and what a week he's having. Next Terrific performances to this point. And most importantly, a place in tomorrow's Swiss Open final. Straight games then in 26 minutes over Lee Zijia. Watanabe through to his first Swiss Open final. A magic moment for him, I am sure. As I mentioned a few minutes ago, that other semi-final is coming up in two matches time. Victor Axelsson and Chao Tian Chen. Please stay with us until the end of the coverage. In a few moments time, we've got women's singles. That other semi-final too. More a sigh of relief from Watanabe. Great week for him.
Well, thanks for sticking with us here at the St. Jacob's Hall Arena in Basel, Switzerland. And don't forget, you can download the Badminton For You, the BWF Badminton For You app by scanning the barcode you can see on screen. Keep up to date with all your favorite players, matches, results, and latest news. Well, straight through today then, eight matches of coverage here live on court number one. We're five matches down. Match number six coming up in just a few moments. Porn Pawi Chochuong of Thailand. She's taking on Gregoria Mariska Tungjung of Indonesia in this women's singles semi-final.